Hi colleagues, I want to give you a quick description and invite into a series of conversations taking place this spring. And these are basically a follow-up to our January 3rd in-service and then the February 4th, First Friday session that Jess and I led. And it's basically trying to keep going with the topic of inclusion and equity and moving it more toward into the classroom application, which is what faculty asked for and wanted to do more of. So basically, here's the logistical info. Um, the main thing is the two different times on Mondays just allow for you to come at whichever fits your schedule better. Read the article before the session. If you're located on another campus and would like to have me come and facilitate the conversation on your campus, I would love to do that. Here are the three readings. Um, this first one presents a really nice model and framework for thinking about uh, culturally relevant teaching. And I really liked this because I could take a look at it and figure out where I saw uh, I had strengths or where I might have um, things to work on. And then the second one is more of a set of activities specifically for biology, but I think we can really apply a lot of these concepts in other areas and it also talks about ways to think about behaving in ways that invite more inclusion and interaction in your classroom. And the third one gives us a really nice model for lifelong learning and lifelong thinking in terms of um, culturally relevant pedagogy. She proposed a model in 1995, talks, reflects about how lots of people have used that model in different ways and how she would revise that today. So um, those are the uh, articles. Come to one, two, or three sessions. If you see this flyer around somewhere, I'd love it if you'd put it up, post it up, invite other people to come. And um, lastly, if you want to be more involved in continuing to plan for these kinds of processes and discussions, please get in touch with Jess Winans or let me know.